Hello guitarists. Today's lesson is going to be about scales. We're going to look at the first major scale, which is C major scale, and how to play that on the guitar within what they call the open position. And then we're going to move on to the A minor scale, which is known as the natural minor scale. <coughs> And again, look at it within the open position. So your C major scale has the notes of C, D, E, F, G, A, B, and then C within the octave. So on the guitar, the first note is on your fifth string, the third fret. And you want to play that with your third finger. That is your first note. And don't forget, make sure your guitar is in tune before, as I did before I started the video. So you've got C, which is on the third fret of your fifth string. So now we want a D, we play the open fourth string. Then we want an E, so we want the second fret of the fourth string. Then F on the third fret. Then an open G, which is your third string. Then A, second fret of the G string for the third string, then an open B, which is your second string, and then first fret of the second string, your C. So putting that together, you've got C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. When you practice it, Try and say the names either out loud or within your head so that you know you're playing them. So you've got C, D, E, F, G, A, V, C. You could even sing it. Here we go. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. Bit of a croaky voice this morning. <clears throat> Never mind about that. I'll sing it in my head. Now. Once you have got used to playing it, and do it slow at first, so we're just ascending at the moment, which is going up through the scale from the lowest note to the high highest. Then you can come down. Okay, and then putting them together, ascending, then descending. Okay, so that is your C major scale, ascending and descending. So practice it slow, use the same fingers that I've used. So we're only using fingers one, two, and three. When we have a note that's on the third fret, we use finger number three. When we have a note that's on the second fret, we use finger number two. And when we have a note on the first fret, we use finger number one. Okay, so now moving on to A minor. A minor has the exact same notes as C major, sorry, the A natural minor, because there are multiple minor scales. And it starts with the A. So we're playing the open fifth string, which is tuned to A. Then we want the notes B, C, D, E, F, G, and then the octave A. So we have A, second fret of the fifth string, B, third fret of the fifth string, C, then we want D, open fourth string for D, then we want E, second fret the fourth string, F, third string, third fret of the fourth string, then open G, which is your third string, and the second fret of that string, the third string, to give you your A. So we have A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A. And again, this time saying the letters. Again, when you're doing it yourself, you can speak them out as you're playing or say them in your head. It could be best to say it out loud. So A, B, C, D, E, F, 
G, A, and then descending. A, G, F, E, D, C, B, A. Okay? Now, once you've got used to playing them, then you practice along with metronome to work on timing. So I've got the metronome here. It's set at 60 beats per minute. You can go slower, you can go faster. It is up to you. So now I'm going to play through the C major scale, ascending and descending, playing one note per beat. Two, three, four. That was not one note per beat. Getting ahead of myself, so. And I missed off the open D. If I've been saying it as I was doing it, that shouldn't have happened. That's why it's important to do it. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. C, B, A, G, F, E, D, C. And the same with the A minor, but I'm not gonna say it out this time. So again, A minor, one note per beat, two, three, four. Okay, and let's just pause that. What we can do is we can combine the previous video from last week where we subdivided the beat through practicing for your scales. So if I keep this metronome at 60 beats per minute, but this time <clears throat> I'm going to play two notes per beat. And I'm gonna do the C major ascending and descending. One, two, three, four. minor. Ooh, mistake. And again, A. There we go. And as I always say, mistakes will happen and that doesn't matter. Okay, so today we've gone and had a look at the C major scale within the open position. And we looked at the A minor scale, which is the natural minor scale within open position, and then practice them along with a metronome. As I said, with a metronome, you can go faster or slower. Okay, enjoy practicing those. I look forward to seeing your videos posted within Class Dojo. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.